on Ice Hockey UK TV in association with Intermotor, joined by the GB captain, Robert Dowd. Robert, game day now, just had a pre-game skate. Just tell us how the guys are feeling ahead of tonight's first big game. Yeah, everybody's excited. It's obviously a big game for us. Uh, starting off the tournament against, obviously, the favourites. So uh, it'll, be, it'll be trial by fire, but we'll we're, we're, we're get chucked in at the deep end and normally good things happen for us. So everybody's excited to get going. Working for GB, playing for GB for a World Championship is very special, but you're three games away from an Olympic Games. How, how special does that feel, that the road there could be an Olympic Games? Absolutely. Like, like, like you said, uh, any time you represent your country is an honour and it's very special, but to be this close to going to the Olympic Games is something a lot of people thought wouldn't really be possible to be even be this close. So three games away from the Olympic Games is something very special and something nobody on that room takes lightly. And we're all under no illusions, it's a tough task. I think Pete Russell said it was one of the toughest you faced. But this team revels on being an underdog, doesn't it? Yeah, absolutely. Like you said, uh, the, the very good sides we're playing against. And obviously, they ranked pretty, pretty uh, heavily higher than us in the, in the league. But it's one of those where we can stick together. And we've made, we've made stuff happen before when we've been really, really bad underdogs. So it's one of those things we're going to try and make a story here. And how key is it to kind of, for players to keep fit you know three games in four days is a tough ask on anyone how key is it for players to really keep fit when you have such turnover of games yeah it, it, it's a very heavy schedule but we're used to those at every world championships it, it's always a heavy schedule anytime you represent the country games are kind of crammed into a weekend or a week so everyone's used to that in that room and uh, obviously everyone's ready to go obviously had a lot of chance this season to get everyone together there was a february olympic qualifiers may's world championship but how's it feel to have everyone back again so soon? Yeah, like you said, it's quick turnaround. It's very quick turnaround, not much of a summer. To, but right back in the room with all the guys and obviously everyone else, we're a really tight-knit group. So it's great to see everybody and everybody's ready to go. And what's the ice like and how to look at the rink? What are your thoughts out there? Yeah, it's a, it's a brilliant arena. Uh, really nice. The ice is hard and fast and so the board, so it'll be a quick game. And just talk about the GB Barmy Army, I gather there's at least 100 coming over to Supporters Club, probably even more with friends and family and other supporters who have made their own way. How, how crucial is their backing night after night when you play? It's brilliant, obviously. They, they, they follow us all over the world. Uh, and they're a special group of people and uh, we can't wait to see them. And just finally, Mark Richardson today equals John Phillips as the all-time leading cap maker. That is some record. Just tell me about Richie and what's made him so just play for so long. He's an incredible player, an incredible person, and uh, for him to, uh, to achieve this is, is special. And uh, it's a testament for what type of person and player he is as, as a leader in that room, and he has been for many, many years. And I, I'm over the moon for him. Appreciate you joining us, Daddy. Thanks a lot. Thank you.